All right, I started doing college basketball games this week for the ninth year, and I got to talk about something that's driving me crazy. It's point guard play. Look, I know basketball has evolved. Used to be in the day, the point guard brought it down, guys ran the wing, cut to the basket, and you tried to run for laps. That's not how it is anymore. How it is now is, look, point guard gets the outlet. Throw it ahead, cool, shoot a three, great. That's the way basketball is set up. That's one way. Point guard gets the ball, comes down, pulls up behind the three-point line. Great. That's another way. That's all modern basketball. Guys don't run for layups. They run for threes. Fine. But like men in black tuxedos, something never goes out of style. And that's solid point guard play. What you do, and I saw Trey Jones do this very well during the Duke game. I saw other guys not do this. If you don't throw it ahead, if you don't kick it to somebody, you take it down, and once you're inside the three-point line, you make your play from one elbow. This is an elbow where the free throw line meets the lane. There's an elbow over there. You don't keep it in the middle of the floor because the defense can play three different people if it's in the middle of the floor. You move the defense by bringing it to one side. Now, pull up jump shoot, great. Go to the rim, great. Back it out, great. But all decisions must be made from here, from there to about right here. Other thing with point guard plays, driving me nuts. Point guard's getting up too high. Guy comes into here, goes in among the trees, and he lifts up, and he tries to make a play. What are point guards normally? They're little people. They're not the big guys. So little guys in basketball need to stay low. If you're trying to make, I don't know, your varsity, don't turn the ball over as a point guard. That's number one. Point guards that turn the ball over sleep in the garage. That's just what they do. Don't turn it over. You want to make the varsity? Don't turn it over. Number two, make the right call. What? Throw it ahead? Great. Throw it up to a big man. Rule on big men. If I'm going to throw it to a big man, he can only have to take one dribble to lay it in. I've seen this screwed up early in the college basketball season. Point guard gets the ball. He's bringing it down. For some reason, he gives it to a big man at the free throw line. What does a big man do? If he doesn't trip and fall, he throws it up against the backboard, misses, or he charges into somebody. That's not the big guy's fault. That's the point guard's fault because he only gives a big guy the basketball when he can take at most one dribble. I'm not asking point guards to rebound. I'm asking bigs to rebound. I'm asking point guards get the ball to the guy in the right spot. And that happens from just inside the free throw line to the free throw line where you make your decision every single time.